Alright, what's up you guys? It's your girl Kimmy back here with another video. Well, stop. Cut. Boom. Hey you guys, so I just got home. So I decided to come and do a little haul for you guys. As to what I got from Dollar Tree. Um, this Dollar Tree that I went to, this particular Dollar Tree from the footage that you came before. It's massive. It's huge, y'all. And I didn't have a backup charge, backup battery charge. So I couldn't record the whole thing, but I got as much footage as I could. So without further ado, oh, and I also went to Big Lots. I'm going to show you guys what I got from Big Lots. Not much, but I'm just a part of the shopping venture. So I'm going to show you guys what I got from Dollar Tree. First up, I'm going to start with this Disney princess bag, you guys. And this does that have the Disney um, tag on it. The Disney princesses. It is that like plastic type bag. It has the black lining on each side. And it also has the pictures front and back, y'all. I got this for Aaliyah. This is super cute. It has all the princesses on it, including Tiana, okay? One of our favorite princesses. And the illustration of their faces on here are everything, okay? It's not like your typical Disney drawing. Um, it looks more sketch-like and adult kind of like-ish. Um, but I really love it. It, even, it has every single Disney princess on here, you guys. And I was surprised to see this at Dollar Tree. Never seen this before. So, yes, I had to grab it. I'm not really sure what I'm going to use it for, but we'll figure it out. For those who don't know, I eat a lot of ice, okay? And I love ice. I'm an ice eater. Yes, every day I eat ice, okay? So, they had these sphere ice molds. And I got them in the color blue. And I think it's one piece in here. So, I'm assuming that this is one whole piece to make them, like, in a ball. But, they, you know, sphere is actually a ball. And, you guys, they're huge. Like, I don't know if you can see that. But, they are freaking huge, though. And I'm, like, super hyped about using them. I'm actually going to open these to see what they look like. And, Michaela was like, Mom, you got to get it. So, it comes like this. This is what it looks like. And, it opens. And I'm guessing you put the water in here. I'm not, oh, you put this on top and run water in the hole. And it keeps it like tight grass. And then when it's frozen, it's like, you know, you take it off and pull the ice cubes out. Y'all, I can't wait to use this. It does have Green Buyer International, which means it is from the Dollar Tree Company, you guys. So, yeah. And then next, I got this calendar undated dry erase board so it is a roll of calendar um it has stickers inside of there for like meetings and events night out date night now originally i got this for the girls but looking at the stickers is more of an adult calendar because it has like bills due date night car renovation this was just super freaking cute and I think I'm going to, I told you guys we were going to make in the front porch into a studio. So I think I'm going to have this on one of those walls down there. It comes with a dry erase marker, which is inside. And it's a dry erase board. So I can't wait to open this. I'm not going to open it now, but super cute. Got that from Dollar Tree. And I've never seen this there before, so I was excited about this. Was this photo frame with the um, different photo... Um, you know the collages i've never seen this at dollar tree before i got two of them because i needed something for like my entryway when i come into the house so i'm just gonna get a bunch of pictures printed out of us and fill them both probably one with the kids and one with Tom and i um i got a box of parchment paper me and babe been talking about the difference between wax paper and parchment so if you know what's the difference comment down below i've been using wax paper thinking that it was the same as parchment paper but it's not wax paper gets stuck to up to everything i think wax paper is used more for diys but this is the 25 sheet parchment um doesn't have like it just says made in usa so i'm assuming that it's a dollar tree brand i think i told you guys before in prior videos that i'm always writing in like books and stuff and journals and just to keep organized i realized that the best thing for me is the binder so i got me a binder it's this blue and green grayish print on it not the cutest, but it was the cutest that they had. This one is actually broke, y'all. It's broke. But it's going to work. Um, so it's from the brand Jot. It's a one-inch binder. And with that, I got a pencil case that goes inside the binder. It has the three little hoops. And it says, your attitude determines your 
direction holes and stuff on it and i'm just gonna put this inside the burner because i'm always losing like pins and stuff next item is this home sign which has fallen apart one of them if i can find that piece but I'll show you the one that hasn't fallen apart. So it's this home sign that they have out right now. I think this is part of the Valentine's Day collection. It is because it has the Valentine's Day tag or print. You know by the the lines on it and the color red, obviously. But this is a massive piece of wood to get from Dollar Tree. Um, when you are a DIYer, it's hard to find like cheap pieces of wood unless you go into like Home Depot and stuff and get like scrap woods. But as far as wood that's already finished. Um, this is a big piece of wood from the from Dollar Tree. So even if you didn't want to like sport this side, you could use this side and paint whatever you want, do whatever you want to it. But it says home. It has like the wood background, the galvanized heart. I really like these. I'm gonna put these on each side of my entryway, like when you first come in. I think this is Dollar Tree brand, y'all. I felt like I heard this um, company before, but I haven't. I thought this was something else because it looks similar to yeah it looks similar to like it's another um unstoppables it looks similar to the unstoppables uh laundry what the hell is it called fabric softener um but this is um the brand breezy from i guess it's a dollar tree brand um chris brown ladies and it reduces wrinkles and it smells good y'all it's in the scent black jasmine lotus and it's awesome smelling we're doing laundry tomorrow. It smells really good, y'all. Like, I'm not typing it. So, grab two bags of potato chips, original wise for the kids. I got a four pack of bad tissue, strong and soft. They do have the Scott tissue, but the Scott tissue is really thick. Like, the plies of it is thick, and it goes really fast, and it's, it can stop your toilet up. These are actually perfect, you guys. Like, I like Dollar Tree tissue. I have no problem with this at all. It lasts us a minute when it's just us seems like when we have more people at our house it just goes but when it's just us like this does our house well so i only got one pack because usually i get my toilet paper from walgreens but i was at dollar tree and we needed some so i picked it up okay thing that i usually get from another store i got the 30 pack of it says 30 oh yeah i got two of the 30 pack of paper plates i usually get these from my dollar magic for like 350 i get like 100 and something plates but again something that we needed and i wasn't near dollar magic so i got them from dollar Tree. so i got two packs of those <clears throat> i got the 25 sheets of foil from the brand reynolds red um i love these y'all i love these freaking sheets okay i'm one of them people who when it comes to that roll and splitting the foil sheets is just fucking traumatic for me you guys sorry for the language but goddamn, like i'm like in your yeah um okay fucking up basically but these help because they come right out and usually they fit whatever i'm working on if not i use two pieces it's good like um quality texture so i'm fine with these but i have got i only got one box this time so two boxes of these super fresh ziploc bags um these are from Dollar Tree brand, it says Greenbrier International Inc. Um, these are just as well, just as good as Glade Ziploc bags to me, or the Walmart knockoff brand Ziploc bags. Um, and it has the expandable bottom, so when you sit it up, whatever you're filling up, it's kind of like a flat surface, and it's better to like if you you put food in the refrigerator, it's it helps with like taking the food out. You're not like dropping a bag and getting food all over the place. It's not as messy. It's, now, I don't usually get this brand. I usually get the regular Clorox. I'm not a fan of lavender, nor am I a fan of lemon when it comes to cleaning products. But, again, something that we needed, we don't have, and it was a dollar. So, I got the Lysol Cling and Fresh Long-Lasting Fragrance um, Toilet Cleaner, Toilet Cleanser. A two-pack of printed scrub sponges from the brand Scrub It, which is also, I feel like it's Dollar Tree. Yeah, Green Bar International came from Dollar Tree's um, manufacturer. So yeah, I love these, y'all. These are like my favorite sponges. The, they do have like the big yellow sponges with the green tops. A lot of people like those because of the grip, but I'm not really a fan of them. They fall apart too easily for me. So I like these better. But I got the twin double blade razors. There are 10 in a pack. These are disposable, you guys. So once you use them, throw them out. Okay, these are not for long-term use. 
Um, these work for me excellent, okay? They're probably on the sharp side. As long as you're careful, like, it's fine for me. I don't know about you, but it's fine for me. And you throw them out, and the next time you shave, you got another one. I don't mind buying these. You get 10 for a dollar. Like. Next, I got this magnetic notepad, you guys. So, lately, I've just been writing on my refrigerator using dry erase markers. I mean, I, yeah, dry erase markers. And it's kind of, like, staying in my refrigerator a little bit. So, I feel like I'm, like low or something i hope i'm like perfect all right so it says, it says to do and reminders it has the magnetic strip on the back so you just sit put it on your um refrigerator and i need stuff like this my mind is always going 10 miles per second and i'm always forgetting stuff and i'm always writing stuff down and, and forgetting stuff that we need so actually i actually need these like all around the house because like i'm the worst when it comes to remembering but yeah you get 50 sheets and it's from the brand jot y'all next also from the brand jot i grabbed these gel pens so muhammad just got these the last trip we went to dollar tree we haven't been to dollar tree in a minute and i used this blue one and it got lost and but i really love the way that these write you would think that because they're from dollar tree like they write all rough and stuff but that's not the case y'all these actually write like real smooth and stuff but it um has every color in there it has orange yellow green purple pink and blue this is also a Dollar Tree product. Jot, I think Jot is a Dollar Tree, Dollar Tree product. Yeah, but I love these, y'all. Go get you some. But this will be used for more so for my notes, for my binder when I start to like, because I'm going to have it like, I should, I'll, I'll, I'll get to that. Girl, shut up. Why are you always talking? Damn. 15 count of these luminous, luminescence. I think I'm saying that right. Tea light candles. I have a lot of tea. I have a lot of candles in my house, and I don't like to put the big candles in them because they melt into the candle and it's hard to get out these you light them they stay lit for a certain amount of time they go out and you replace them i love these and plus you get 16 for dollars these are usually cheap everywhere you go this ead and it says compared to dracker noir by guy la Roche. it's called excess fragrance body mist and um excuse me but he is taking do you see that yes that's a six pack yes honey but anyway y'all they had two of these they had a blue and a black one left what caught my eye was if they were the last two on the shelf so i'm like yo they must smell good and i sprayed the blue one the blue one was oh my god it smells so good but this one smells even better y'all oh my god it just smells like it smells really really good really really good so i got this from Muhammad. it smells so good y'all and the boys because it's like it's not a hard smell like the boys can wear it too but you get um I'm not sure if EAD is like a company. I feel like I've heard of it before. Um, super glue gel for my dollar for y'all. If you are a DIY crafter, I suggest it. There's a couple different glues that I love. And if you've seen the clip before, you know that one of them are the foam board glues. They are bomb. When it comes to like um, cardboard, foam board, paper, stuff of that nature. This shit right here works bomb on like glass and stuff like that. And it says... No runs or drips cures quickly. I am going to say this. It has a precision applicator, but when you are applying it to whatever you are applying it to, do not be up close to it. The smell of it, oh my God, it's like somebody is punching you in the goddamn nose. Like, it's, it's harsh. But it works, okay? The kids were craving hot sauce, so they picked up a Frank's Red Hot Hot Sauce. I noticed yesterday that we, out, we were out of hot sauce, and everybody in my house eat hot sauce, okay? Even down to the babies. They love it. So I got one of those. Couple bags. And the scent vanilla is from April Bath and Showers. We've seen this brand at Dollar Tree all the time. I actually think this is a Dollar Tree brand. Yes, Green Fire International. Y'all, um, so this is what I'm going to say about bubble baths. I know that there probably are more expensive bubble baths out there, but this does the job for me. Um, I do have to use almost a lot of it. Like, this is for me is about three baths, but I take a lot of baths. You know, like, not, not a lot of people take baths on a regular, so it'll probably go further with other people. But because I take a lot of baths, <laughs> um, it goes faster for me. But it is if you are a person that do not take baths on a regular, just get you some of this. Don't don't spend six or seven dollars on Dove. And plus, I mean, to each his own. But I've had the Dove bubble bath, and it it didn't excite me too much. Okay. Two cans of this Nine Lives meaty pate with real meat for the kittens and the cat. And I also got two packs of these self adhesive hooks. Actually, I'm going to be slowly redoing our house. Nothing major, no big renovations, but little stuff here and there. I have these baskets as well. They come three in a pack. They had the wire ones, but the wire ones was one for a dollar. So I was like, why do that? And I could just get six for two dollars. 
but I'm gonna be making my own spice racks with these. So I grabbed these and I grabbed some hooks and I'm, this is gonna be like an easy little DIY. If you guys wanna see it, I'll, you know, I'll record it. I got some index dividers with pockets, y'all. They had the regular ones, the index dividers, but I've never seen the pockets one. So I was like really hype about this because not only do I have labelers, but I have pockets. So my plan is to have, it has five pieces in here and this is also from their brand Jot. And my plan is to separate them, like recipes, deli, journal, um, schedule, meetings. Um, I, I, I should have got two, honestly, because I had so much going on in my life. Um, but if I need more, I'll just go back. But it comes with like the little tags that you slip in here. They're color coordinated and it has a pocket in each divider. So this will be a part of my planner I'm gonna make. I also have a lot of stickers. Like my planner's gonna be cute when I'm finished with it, but yeah. Got that. And I was going to go sticker crazy today, but I'm like, no, I need to go through what I have already and, like, really sort through my stuff to see what I got. Because we have so much stuff here, you guys. We have so much stuff that we need to, like, give out and give to people. And it's just so much stuff in the house. It's too much. Honestly, it's like, too much. All right, this is actually new, you guys. So this is also from the brand Scrub It. And it is a scrubber. It says, odor resistant and non-scratch, soft, warm water for gentle scrubbing and cleaning. Firm and cold water for deep cleaning and scrubbing. So if you are cleaning like a pot, something heavy, use cold water and it keeps it hard like this. This is hard, y'all. But if you want it for like your dishes and you don't want it to scratch, well, it's not scratch. But if you want it for like your glasses and your dishes, you put it in warm water. And I thought this was so cool. It says good for the entire home. It has like the bathroom, outside, kitchen, pots. Yeah. I'm like super soaked about this, y'all. And is this from, is this a Dollar Tree? It does not say, it says Scrub It Net. So let me know down below, is Scrub It a company? Because I feel, I feel like I've seen this like logo here. I got this coconut and oat flour shaving cream. I don't have any more in the bathroom. Um, so I got this one. It is from the brand Pure Silk. I got me some, every time I go to Dollar Tree, I love their little like slippers. I don't know why, even their like open toe slippers, I love them. Um, I can't find mine. I had like four pair. I don't know where they at. But um, I grabbed these. They're a size five to nine. I don't know how that works. But and they're just like some blue slippers with the white fur inside of them. I usually wear these when I'm going to get um, out the shower because they have like the hard bottom. And then next, I got this picture hanging kit that has 55 pieces in here. Um, this is, of course, the pictures I'm going to be hanging stuff, and it's just easier. It comes with everything, you guys. It comes with 24 nails that hold up to 4 to 50 pounds, 10 to 30 pounds. It comes with wire, six eye hooks, everything you need to hang your pictures. Usually, I won't spend a lot of money on books. I'll either go to my Goodwill or I'll go to Dollar Tree. I just found some jewels in the rough, okay? But I found these three books and it has to be there's a series it has to be a series because on it it says a story with moral values they kind of have like the same type of like um i don't know like illustrations to me but first i got this j travels back into time book it doesn't have a retail price on here so i'm yeah it's a it's a dollar tree book so it was made for dollar tree but the Jake is like holographic, y'all. And I love, y'all know I'm big on illustrations and kid books. It, you need something that like captures their their little minds, okay? And the illustrations are bomb. Y'all, the colors in this, look at that. And not to mention that the papers are, the, the pages are pretty thick for this book. But the illustrations in these books are bomb. Look at that, look at that clock. That's so cute. And that's what the back looks like. And they're all kind of the same kind of book. This one is Lucky Needs Help. As I said in the other book, illustrations are on a beam. I like big pictures and colors. They keep their attention. Look at that. That is so nice. Four dollar, like. And all of these books are like moral value associated. Um, Sophia the Golden Unicorn. I thought Aaliyah would like this. It has that same holographic. Um, and that's what I'm saying. All of the words have like that same. So I'm guessing it's like a series. They didn't have all of them. These are the only three they had. So comment down below if you know of other ones. Because I'm really trying to like. They have a lot of books that's like broken up and tore. And I'm trying to like transfer them out. But look at look at that. Look at these pictures. Like what kid is not going to sit down and look at these pictures? 
another thing. I need to get back to reading the mind. Look at this. But yeah, I thought this was a steal, y'all from Dollar Tree, okay? All right, moving on. Y'all know that I collect bowls for Aaliyah. I, I had fallen off a little bit because, like I said, we buy, I buy too much stuff and I'm running out of storage. But um, I, I couldn't resist, y'all. So I've never seen these bowls in here. Um, these are also Dollar Tree Incorporated. And they are these purple it's like a galaxy looking bow y'all i can't even explain it but the 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 material the fabric or material is bomb it has like these stars and moons and they're shiny and it's it's made really nicely like even the um the band like it's not cheap but it's really pretty i got this color which is like a purple and blue y'all I, I hope y'all can see that it's so pretty and then i got this green ah, like green blue and black when I'm telling y'all I'm loving these colors because so many times you go in the stores and they only got pink and purples for girls. Like, these colors are bomb. Like, I don't know. It's just... And then I grabbed these for the girls. So, the girls are trying to do, like, this boho theme for their room. I think that's bohemian or something like that. And this is just scream boho to me, okay? And it's just a regular picture frame. I'm just the, the raw wood that got me. I'm not sure what this is. Like, you just put their name or something in it. But I was going to put a picture of both of them in it with their nicknames in each of these. Just something simple to go on, like their dresser or something. But they're, they're 3.5 by 5 frames. And if you don't know, go to your Dollar Tree in the picture frame section. Don't spend $7, $8 on a small frame and you can get it from Dollar Tree. Now, I may say the bigger the frame, um, the flimsier it is. Like, it might break. So, not promise to, like, buy a banging ass frame okay all right so this i actually seen on somebody else's haul and i had to get it big nose like i freaked out when i seen it so i got this for the, the cats um this is a pet bowl placement so if you see my kitchen i always have like a rug or something under their placements but the rugs that i have they get like really dirty and they move they're movable this have has that like non-skid on the back so it's not going nowhere and then the front is like a kitten and it's furry and it's washable y'all and it says 100 percent polyester but it's washable y'all and it's so cute i seen this on another haul i was like i gotta go get it so i got that one. Oh, but you know i couldn't count out my dog oreo right so i got him a pet bowl mat as well and i tried to coincide the colors a little bit but this is like maybe a darker brown than that but it again is machine washable absorbent fast drying and i wonder does it have it has that same like non not as much as that one though that one i feel like it's like more stickier than this i feel like this might slide but let's see how big this is y'all because they didn't have one open in there oh okay it's cute it's a cute little size it looks like it's bigger on this picture though they just happen like, them bowls is big as hell. Girl, bye. Y'all, I'm thirsty. I got, I vowed to not buy any more toys, y'all. Because they have stuff under the tree that's not even open yet. But I, I haven't seen this at Dollar Tree. And I think this is the freaking cutest, okay? They have this princess crown and eye jewelry. Like, face jewelry. And this is what it looks like on your child. And I just thought this was so cute. This is something that me and Leah can do together. She likes to look pretty on a daily basis and it's just so simple and cute i feel like she would like something like this just to run around with this all day but look at that look at that crown and the jewels they show you where the jewels go around the eyes that's and it smells good from dollar it tree smell like the, uh, i just told them that i'm like god damn the brute if it smell like brute i'm gonna be amazed no, mm -mm, it's, not about it's lighter. It's lighter though. Right. But this, this, get y'all man some of this. I'm telling y'all, this shit right here, it's not from Dollar Tree, but the, the oh my god, it smells so freaking good. And mm, I like when my man smell good. Like it's just mm. okay. Look some stuff I found here, and I was like, what? Uh uh. All right, like one, like this. This was a wild factor for me. So I don't like Dollar Tree scarves, y'all. I mean, each is on. They do have some cute patterns if you want to buy your kid one. But this scarf right here is from Dollar Tree, which I've never seen. First of all, the length is crazy. Like, 
if you are a DIYer, you see what you can do with this print, okay? I personally will wear this just how it is. I like scarves depending upon the coat that I'm wearing, but I really like scarves. But look how thick, look how thick this is. I've never. Usually their scarves are really thin or really short. And it has the little bottom with things on it. Girlfriend, hold up. Girlfriend, let's try this on real quick. Look at this. Like, well, I wear my scarves like this. But it's the fact of the matter is, it's Dollar Tree and it's long enough to do this. And they had different colors, y'all. Look, this is how I wear my scarves. This is so cute. Girl. Girl. You thought you'd never catch me in a Dollar Tree scarf. What? But wait, let's keep it on. Mm, proud Dollar Tree really stepping their game up, y'all. I'm telling y'all, I am shocked. This is something I could have wrapped up and gave somebody for Christmas, and they would have never known it was from Dollar Tree. Not that it matters, but they would have never known. The thing I got are these Brillo Basic Reusable Wipes, you guys. Um, I, I, I used to buy these a while back, and I stopped. But these are actually bomb, okay, because they're like paper towels plus. Um, you can reuse them. I don't use mine several times. I, you know, I feel like after a certain amount of cleaning, you can throw them out because they do start to get dirty. But they are durable as hell. Like, you can wash these out and use them, like, for your whole, say you're doing a day of cleaning. It will make it through your whole day of cleaning. You get nine in here. So, I got two packs, okay? I think y'all seen these before. I got the Purina Moist and Meaty um, Chopped Burger Mills for Oreo. So, there's two in a box. And they're both the same kind, and they're from Purina. We're gonna move on. Oh, wait, one more bag. Wait, I think this is all for now. Oh, no, no. All right, and then I grabbed two of these candles. One is called Copper Sands. First of all, can we admire the outside of this candle? Like, the gold top. What? Seriously, like, this looks really fleekish. And my whole thing, I'm gonna have to use a heating tool to get this off because I like it. I just like the, you know the candle itself oh my god that smells bomb okay this one is called copper sands and this one is called mermaid reef they both smell really good now the thing is about dollar tree candles i know people don't buy them because you don't really smell them but as my girl um crafty girl says you have to burn them in smaller places so usually these will go in like bathrooms especially if you have like a one and a half bath um I wouldn't burn these with the with the what's the intent or expectation of them being like real big smells because that's not what Dollar Tree is for. Naya got her some. She's been on this like she wants to try makeup out, so she got these whiskey natural light um, eyelashes. Um, she's like me. She don't like the big spider looking ones. Um, 3D foam ink lashes. Just something she can you know play around with. You never know. She might be the next. Um, big hair styles or big um, makeup styles, okay? This is that second bag of chips. The rest of this is like candy and stuff for tonight. This is tonight's bag, actually. The first thing is kind of subtle, you know what I'm saying? But I thought these were so cute. Now, they had these in matte and shiny. Of course, I have the matte one. It's these little elephants, y'all. And it's just a decor piece. Not really sure where I'm putting them at. But the print on these is so cute. It's like a triangle print. It's, it's giving me like Egypt vibes. I don't know. But they are so cute. Even if you wanted to like repaint these, you could because they're matte. So any paint will stick to them. Spray paint, regular paint, acrylic paint, I feel like will stick to them. Um, bathroom paint, any type of paint you want to use. But I think I like them white and matte. Um, I even thought about gluing them on like raw wood. When I seen these, I was like, oh my God. Yes. Dollar Tree. Okay. So they had these quacks. And I, they are from Dollar Tree manufacturer, y'all. Decor pieces, y'all. Look at this. This is first of all. Let's talk about how well, how wellly made. I don't know if I'm even saying that right. How made? How greatly made these are? Okay. So it's a thick piece of wood, as you can see. And I feel like we've seen this with like the wood, like they they did this before. But this is different. Like the wood and the freaking gold on on the front of it with the plant y'all and it's double layered like i don't know if you can see that y'all they did the damn thing with this and it's like really perfect like even the lettering on it i don't know if anybody is like how i am with dollar tree but they did so good on this and this is a dollar tree brand this is from greenbrier international which is a, from the dollar tree manufacturer y'all this was bomb okay Oh my 
going on? Thumbnail, okay, bitch? Look at this shit. All right, so then this one broke a little bit, but I, I'm glad it broke because I wanted to show you something because I thought about this. So, yes, the gold is pretty. I like the gold. This one says believe, but if even if you were to pull this off, look at that wood. It's like an unfinished wood. Y'all, when I tell you, my DIY antennas, look how it's coming off. Like, it's not even ugly if this gold was to come off. Like, I'm liking that tinge of, like, damaged wood. Y'all. So, I got believe. I got home. Which I showed you guys. I got love. And I got hope. Okay, all of them have like the flowers on the end. I'm even thinking about making like a stand, a tiered, three tiered stand out of these, y'all. These are so cute. I, I don't know. I don't know what I would do with these yet. But I just, I got all of them. No, I think it was two more. I think it was one that said family, which I'm tired of the family logo at Dollar Tree. So I didn't get that one. And I think it was one that said blessed. Do I have blessed? Yeah, I think it was one that said blessed. All right, so y'all, go to your Dollar Tree and get those. Next thing, I'm like, what? So I seen these. These were not on the shelf. I did not see these anywhere in the store. I first seen them when I went in, and I'm like, what are those? Like, they don't have a tag on them, right? So we go back. You know, I do like a second round where I just like sweep through the store and try to and forget anything. And I seen these, y'all. These show these things. So I'm like, what are those? So the girls like, you know, we thought about everything, spice rack, all that, but I'm like, it don't have a bottom, like. So then I. Am, both Nia and Michaela's at the same time. Like, they're plate holders. Like, plate organizers for your cabinet. So, I'm like, uh-uh. So, I told them to go get a plate. Yes, they are. They they hold perfectly. So, this is amazing because we've been eating these. You can actually use that hanging kit and get them, like, stuck on the surface and glue these up. And you can have your plates. Not glue them up, but screw them up. You can have your plates on this. And it looks like it's not going to hold, but I'm telling y'all, we stacked plates on here and it held the plates, like, while I'm holding it. This, I've never seen this at Dollar Tree, y'all. Never. And these are only two, two that I've seen. I think they, like, went off the shelves, like, hella fast. Like, and I, I, you know, I have the shelves like this in my downstairs, um, my kitchen cabinets, like, to sort out my stuff. But I've never seen these, y'all. And we were, for those who don't follow me, um, who are just watching for the first time our, when our cabinets fell which was our plate cabinet so I have been like brainstorming as to how I'm going to put my plates up how I'm going to rearrange my kitchen y'all if I can get more of these y'all I will have like a whole thing of these in my cabinets I swear to god like these are it okay so yeah great find alright and then I'm sure you guys seen this in Dollar Tree before this is the shower caddy I actually needed one to put um, Muhammad bought me a bath pillow and I don't, it has like a hook on it and I don't have nowhere to hang it. And plus I want to like have my own little section for my own little things. We have one of these in the bathroom already. Um, and it's not so much for like big stuff because we, we want to get like a shower caddy, a shower caddy. But I kind of just like having my own, you know, my own little section where I can put like my stuff, my toothbrush and all of that in the shower. So I got these. This, I got this magnetic planner, you guys. So I grabbed both of those things because I need both of those things, okay? I'm, you're probably like, you got two magnetic planners, but this one is more of a weekly planner. Dry erase, goes right on the refrigerator. The whole bag is magnetic. It's from the plan Jot, you guys, and it comes with a magnetic pen. I also like the little parts at the bottom in the purple um, outline, and it has Monday through Sunday on there. It says this week. I thought that was really cute, y'all. And this is the only one I've seen. I wish they had more, because I probably would've got more maybe like have one for each older kid so i can see like their assignments or if there's any appointments that i'm not thinking of at the time i probably i'll probably go get more of these i actually stuck snuck these in the cart y'all because i'm going to be work me and i'm going to be making like baskets for valentine's day to give out to each kid so i didn't want to do the whole buy cards they're not in school we don't need to do all that so i just got them individual cards but all the cards have scooters y'all they have scoot i mean um what are these called? Skateboards. And like the little miniature skateboards. No, I'm adding it. Um, all of them are so cute. They have a hedgehog. They have the hot dog. Ma I have a magical Valentine's Day. I have a magical Valentine's Day. Your, I can't see what that says, but. Your something amazing. XOXO and the sloth that's less hang. I think the sloth thing is like pulling me in. Because me and the kids are talking about how I need an animal. And everything sloth on it. I'm like, oh, that's so cute. So cute. So cute. So I, I, it's either going to be a sloth or a hedgehog at this point. Because they are so freaking cute. So, y'all. May I have your attention, please?
Valentine's Day is coming up. Excuse me. We interrupt the station for this special broadcast. Valentine's Day is coming up, y'all. Can't wait. Now we can turn y'all back to y'all regularly right schedule. So next, while I don't have anything else this wild the hell out of me i seen these yes wait a couple days ago I, but i was there for i was just there for a certain amount of time i was just there for a certain amount of time so i was like you know i'm not gonna get them but i got these so this one is a longer container and lid it's from the brand sure 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 fresh and that's what it looks like. This actually looks like glass, y'all. Like, it really does. Like, it has, like, the lines on it. But these are microwavable. And only reason I thought about getting these is because the other day, I think it was yesterday, I was trying to reheat something. And um, it needed a top. Whatever it was, it needed rice. It was. I was trying to heat something up in the microwave because I don't know how to cook rice, y'all. And it said on the instructions that it needed a top. And I thought about this. So, I just got them just in case. I got three of them. I got this one long one and then I got two of the circular ones and this also is a I want to say yeah green briar product as well all right and then I got two of these black ink rulers Tom has these and I like how they write so I got one um 0 0.7 millimeter ballpoint pen and it's black I got those all right um Another great find, y'all. So at, at Walmart, a long time ago, I had seen these and they were four dollars for one, and I was like, oh no, never. And then I started watching Dollar Tree hauls, and people all over the Dollar Tree stores started getting them. So they are from Vagisil, y'all. First of all, they smell like when I went in the aisle, I was looking for these, and when I went in the aisle, I could smell them. Like that's how good they smell. So they are the brand Vagisil. They are bath bombs and it says vagina friendly. Um, this is the white jasmine scented. This is for relaxing all body bath experience with vitamin E. And it's one bath bomb in here, y'all. And it is a name brand. Y'all know what Vagisil is. Now, I'm not too big on bath bombs, but I'm big on the brand Vagisil. So, oh my God, y'all. First of all, the packaging is so cute. Like, you could have... If I would have known about this, this is stuff that you could give to people in their stock and stuff for like, oh my God. All right, go for that. But that was like a good kind. I had four of them originally, but I'm like, I'm, I might use them and not like them. So calm down, Kimmy, bring it back a little. All right, and then next, y'all know back in, when Christmas first started, I was looking everywhere for these, for these candle holders. And they're just the regular glass candle heart holders. Y'all, these can be used for several DIYs. It's just good to have them on hand. They go so fast that you need to just buy them, okay? They had a lot of them. I don't, I didn't feel like buying a lot of them. I think I bought about four of them, which is enough for me because even if I wanted to do something, I'm very patient when it comes to getting what I want. So, um, you know, I could have, if I'm doing a DIY and I need them, and I go past that four limit, I can wait to get the other one. I won't display it or whatever I'm doing until I have all of those pieces. The rest of this Dollar Tree stuff is glass. So these y'all, these y'all, these. These are like my favorite thing that I've got today, okay? Dollar Tree has, oh, uh, well, it's not, this, is, this is not it, but this is cute too. Dollar Tree has these candle holders that if you go to the Dollar Tree section, which you've probably seen in the first clip, they have tons of like little statues, vases, candle holders, but these right here I feel like are so well made. They have the gold top strip and they're black. They also had them in white and clear. And these are the candles that I say are just for display where you put your tea lights in them. Why am I smelling it like it has a goddamn candle in it? Weirdo. But yeah, I got two of these. Two black ones. Not really sure where I'm gonna put them yet. But I like those couple last items i want to show you guys so i also got these y'all these when i seen these in dollar tree i was so hyped these are freaking cute they are glass cut glass mugs that you can put hot and cold drinks in them the style of them are so cute like i'm thinking about going back to get more of course michaela hates it because i just have an obsession with cups but 
Um, I plan on putting like coffee in these, making it look real cute. Like I really wanted to like buy straws today. Like I don't even drink with straws, just to be like, you know, oop, I'm gonna drop it. Like, you know, that type of vibe or whatever. But these are so cute, y'all. Go see y'all Dollar Tree and grab these up because they are going fast. Like it was only like three left, and I grabbed two. I didn't want to grab it an even number. I'm weird like that. <laughs> Alright, then from Big Lots, only grabbed the uh, Big Lots, yeah, only grabbed a few new, few things. I got this six pack of paper towels from the brand Irresistible. It was five dollars and fifty cent. There are six rolls in here. Never used this brand before, um, but it'll get us through until I need another one. I usually I usually get my toilet paper and my paper towel from Walgreens. They had their paper towel is like equal to Bounty or Scott's. I like the way it feels. Um, so yeah, and then. Prior to Christmas, our old curtain and shower liner got messed up due to the fact that we had several people in here with us. Um, so yeah, I grabbed this tomato red shower curtain. It is fabric and it is from the brand Living Colors. This cost me $8, you guys. And I kind of went for the red because I already have some towels in here that are not so much Christmas towels, but they are towels that we use for Christmas and I'm not going to take them out. So I might as well match it with the curtain, right? And then I grabbed this. Um, I know you could get, you, if you wanted to go like the cheaper route, you can get um, shower liners from Dollar Tree for a dollar. Now, they are nothing like these, you guys. These last a very long time, and these can be wiped down. The, the ones at Dollar Tree, they, they tend to rip really easily. But this is from the brand Kenny, and it is it says Piva Shower Liner, eco-friendly weighted hem. So that means at the bottom, it's not like sticking to you, it's weighted onto the, um, the, um, yeah, it has magnets on the bottom, so it like sticks to the tub. But I got this for three dollars. So for two dollars more, you might as well get you a nice shower liner because the plastic ones drive me crazy. Okay. And then um, it's about time for the babies to throw their old toothbrushes away. They they already had the motorized toothbrushes, but it's um it's been about three months, so it's time for new ones. So the last two items that I got last, like I was saying, um, it's about time to switch their toothbrushes out. Um, I advise everybody to you know start switching toothbrushes out at three month period been about almost three months so um big lots had the brand firefly which was only 275 and i got this black panther one for kai and it says turbo power antibacterial covers i got the iron man one for roddy and i got the barbie one for Aaliyah. this looks like has barbie on it these both have like avenger characters at the bottom this is actually the same toothbrush with different tops so i got those and then I just grabbed this because it was on sale. This was 52 cent. It's a college rule 150 sheet pack of white paper, lined paper, and I needed this for the binder, of course. So yeah, you guys, that is all. Um, that's all of this haul. If you guys like this haul, make sure that you give it a fat thumbs up. Also, if you made it this far, comment white hearts and black hearts with the pound Ali game sign. Um, outside of that, you guys, I think I spent about $96 at Dollar Tree which was not bad and I spent $34 at Big Lots which is getting not bad because I also got like a thing of bleach I got some bleach that's not up here and I got him a body wash I got him an Old Spice body wash so that's why I came up to like $34 that I didn't show in here but this is more so a Dollar Tree haul so yeah make sure you guys give this video a fat thumbs up if you like this video comment down below if you want to see more videos like this also please press that subscribe button if, this, if your button is not gray that means that you are not subscribed to the channel that button should be gray, okay? If it's still red, you need to press it, okay? Also, be sure to press that post notification bell so you will not miss out on a video or a live, okay? And also, if you're new to the channel or if you're thinking about subscribing, just subscribe, y'all. Yo. You might stay here for a while. You might like our content. If you're new to the channel, welcome. We love you, okay? As every as we love our A1D ones, okay? So, yeah. Um, With that being said, I'm going to go ahead and get because I got things to do and stuff to put away. I love you guys. We love you guys. And you already know what it is. It's Ali Gang. And I'm out. Peace.